Chelsea Green has come under fire like Bismarck in World War II here because Chelsea Green has posted hashtag Chelsea for Chelsea at Dowdery. Welcome back to Fog Wrestling. And of course, this has lifted some rocks up. This has lifted some trees. They're not happy about this due to the impending court case and trial and allegations towards Vincent Kennedy McMahon. So it's not looking too good. For Chelsea Green. What I say is not looking too good for Chelsea Green. I don't think anything will happen for this, but she could lose a bit of, um, you know, not a, but a bit of followers, a bit of support behind her because the, regardless of this, people are saying it's like tone deaf without me to write this. And I guess she can, as much as I think at the end of the day, it looked consensual in the text messages. I mean, it's not exactly the greatest thing to write. Hashtag justice for Chelsea because at the end of the day you know the whole th there's not hashtag but there's the movement hashtag hashtag for Janelle Grant so you can absolutely see why people who are in the Janelle Grant thing would take us bad their side but the reality is there's no there's no proof to McMahon that he's done anything wrong and there's no verdict yet and it's a doubt we he's been removed for doubt we it's not like he's still there and they've gone with this hashtag so, I mean, what are Dyer are we supposed to do? Not do any storylines that revolve in any of this? So, is, is no one backstage allowed to take a shit ever again because McMahon shot on Janelle Grant? I mean, wh wh where do you draw the line? You know, I don't think we're going to be getting any, like, DX and uh, Spirit Squad segments where someone's literally going to get shot on. But at the end of the day, are we going to get Mark Henry getting his subway shot on either? You know, there's a lot going down here. There's a lot going down, and I don't think we're going to get it all the way down in Chinatown, to be perfectly honest. So, I mean, come on. I think people just need to have a thick skin, but it's 2024. The world is absolute shite bags. And I knew, as soon as I seen this tweet, hashtag justice for Chelsea, they were going to be crying about it. They were going to be, oh, how tone deaf can you be? Oh, justice for... I mean, it's a fucking storyline. I mean, come on. Justice... I mean... It, the whole justice for Chelsea Green, though, it's to do with, like, you know, she, how she got shafted out of the spot elimination chamber and, like, corrupt referees. How is that in any way relevant to the other thing? It just doesn't. I mean, it, it would be... Uh, no, you, you, you can't even relate the two, man. It's just people out there sad, willing to, you know, absolutely throw themselves down. I don't know if any chance they get. It's disgraceful. It really, really is. To say the least. Right, and you can't spin it any other way. It's just people looking to drag down a wee down to the depths of hell. Know that hell meme. Welcome to hell, motherfucker. That's it. That's all people want to do with down a wee. It's all they want to do. And you can't do anything about it. These people are just absolute fuds, to say the least. Because that is all they're doing. Bashing down a wee. And all they do wake up and they went, oh, we're going to bash WWE today, that's what we're going to do, WWE this, WWE that, Chelsea Green, how dare she use that hashtag, It'd be different if, you know, if it was an like actual guilty verdict, McMahon was fine guilty, but there's nothing, if anything the evidence supports them being innocent, so I don't know what, I don't, I don't really understand what people want for Vince McMahon, or say, say Vince, like what people want for WWE, is this supposed to drop all storylines in case it upsets the the slightest minority. It's a joke. Anyway, guys, hashtag for Chelsea Green has absolutely backfired. Leave your thoughts down below. Check out the raw review for you earlier. And peace.